Now moving on to reflexes and muscle tone. We want to assess neuromuscular status, and it's very important for infants. So let's play the top seven reflexes to know four exams from this pediatric segment. Now switching gears to infant reflexes, the top three tested to know and to write down is number one, the Babinski reflex. That typically shows up zero to 12 months. It's where the toes fan out when stroking the sole or bottom of the foot. Number two is the rooting or sucking reflex, seen around zero to four months old. Sucking motion when stroking the side of the cheek or mouth. And lastly, number three is the tonic neck reflex, zero to four months. Now this one's a little bit difficult to understand, so listen close. When placed on the back, the head turns to one side and the infant flexes the arm of the opposite side, sort of like stretching out the other arm that the child is facing. So Kaplan had a question here, a nine month old. The nurse expects which reflex, Babinski. And Hesse had two questions. What is the reflex assessed by stroking the outer sole of the foot, Babinski? And how will the nurse assess the rooting reflex by stroking the cheeks of the newborn? And ATI mentions the big one here. A two-month-old infant placed on their back and head turned to one side. The infant responds by flexing the arm of the opposite side and extending the arm that is pointing the same direction she is facing. Which of the following best describes this reflex? The tonic neck reflex. And some other general reflexes to know is the moral reflex, zero to four months old, often called the startle reflex. It's in response to a loud noise or sudden movement. The infant stretches out their arms and legs like they're startled, but then immediately pulls them back into the body. And stepping reflex is one month plus, also called the walking or dancing reflex. This can be seen when the baby is held upright or when the baby's feet are barely touching the ground, kind of like they're dancing. So go baby, go baby, moonwalk it, oh yeah. <laughs> Okay, the next one is the Palmer grasp, zero to three months. This is also called the grasp reflex. So infants will grab onto any object placed in their palm, be it a finger, a toy, spoons, money, or even that new Louis Vuitton bag. Ooh, baby, you got some style. Okay, now the last one here is the planner grasp, zero to eight months. Very similar to the Palmer grasp. But placing objects under the toe, the infants will curl their little toes around the object in attempt to grasp it with their plantar reflex. Now a big key point here is good muscle tone. This is key as healthy muscles are never fully relaxed. Newborns normally have increased muscle tone and often resist movement of the extremities. Now what's not normal and must be reported to the HCP is decreased muscle tone, like hypotonia, as well as head lag, big NCLEX tips. Be sure to write down those key points, as this may indicate neurological abnormalities like Down syndrome or even spinal injury. Hey, did you see the new study guide that follows along with this video? So cut your study time in half and increase your retention of the need to know key points and memory tricks that love to come up on nursing school exams. Plus get 900 more videos not here on YouTube, neatly organized into playlists. Try it for free. Visit